Hey guys, Theo here. And if you've been watching me for a while, you may remember a few months ago, I created a video where I baked cookies without a recipe. Today I thought it'd be a fun idea to get back into the kitchen, but stepping it up a notch. Today, I'm going to be making, attempting, a cake without a recipe. With a blindfold on. So today I'm going to be attempting a pretty stock standard vanilla cake and I have got some of the ingredients out which I think I'll need. Just the basic baking ingredients. And it has been a while since I baked a cake even with the recipe. So let's just hope my memory is here for me today. Right. Ah! No! No! Oh! Crap! This glass bottle of vanilla essence was literally centimeters from rolling off the table. So as far as I know, you put the dry ingredients in, and then you make a well, and you put the wet ingredients in, and then you just mix it up. So I guess we'll start with some flour. So I'm just getting out a scoop of this. Wait, should I measure it? Should I sip it? I think I'm gonna go for one cup. Actually, you need quite a bit of flour, don't you? Let's just make a small cake. Face it, this is just gonna be a waste of ingredients. Now I just have to sip that in. Just like so. Hopefully this is going into the bowl. All right, so I'm gonna place that there. Crap. Oh my gosh. I just remembered how to make a cake. You're supposed to cream butter and sugar together first. And then you add egg, and then you add dry ingredients. I hate my life. I didn't even get butter out because I thought who needs butter in a cake? Ow. I hate this stupid branch decoration! I have my butter. I'm putting that in the bowl. Oh, I really should have washed my hands before doing this, shouldn't I? This sounds like sugar, right? I have no idea how much is going in right now. Ah! Too much sugar. I'm pretty sure I just put in way too much sugar. How do I get this out? How do I get this out? Okay. Oh, wait. Don't usually use a machine for this. Ain't nobody gonna tell me to use a machine blindfolded. I think you can do this with your hands too, right? So it's just like making pastry. Wait, maybe this is what you do when you make pastry. What if I'm doing this completely wrong? So a couple minutes in, I think the only thing it's doing is getting into my fingernails. How's it going? Seeing as I can't see for myself. I hate this. But when you think about it, I don't even need to be doing this. I'm the one that put this blindfold on and made myself do a blindfold in baking video. I could just take the blindfold off and cook a nice cake like a normal person and actually have something to eat at the end of this. But where's the fun in that? My kidding. Where's the fun in this? <sighs> I think I didn't need that sugar after all. This is wet. Oh, just like me after I ate that. Why don't I bake cakes more often? This is so good. Okay, egg time. If I can find eggs. Ooh, I'm gonna try to crack it with one hand. That's something I've never done before. <gasps> Call me Nigella Lawson. And we'll whisk that up into a nice little paste. <laughs> I feel like the only way I can test if it's done is to feel the consistency with my finger. No, not done. I don't do physical exercise. My arms are not cut out for this. Now time. Do, 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 do. One and a half cups down. I feel like I'm ready to make this with my brain. Maybe I should just... I definitely just felt flour flicking onto my arm. Maybe I should just do every video like this. Maybe I should delete all my videos, start my channel again, pretending I have no eyes. And then I'll go viral from that. And then when I hit 2 mil subscribers, I'll take off my mask and be like, ta-da, now I can see. How else did I edit my videos all this time? It's gonna add a little bit of milk. You don't wanna add too much because otherwise it just gets it too wet and you have to add lots of dry stuff. So you just have to add it gradually and then just stop when you've got the consistency you want. Now I just have to add the vanilla because it's a vanilla cake and it wouldn't be a vanilla cake unless we had the vanilla. Something's moving, it's touching my hand. What is that, what is that? What is that? Oh, it's just moving. Where are you? Huh? Yes. That sound is never good. It's kind of like when those science people come to your school in your first few years of primary school and they make you punch that slimy goo stuff and then it goes hard so your hand doesn't actually get wet and go through it. Okay. 
Okay, not at all like that. I hate baking. Let me be done with this cake. I'm wash my hands, get the tin, and I'll be back. Okay, so I really can't tell how big this cake is, but it. Ow! Ow! I'm not even kidding when I say I'm actually having an awful time. Ah! I forgot to spray it. Please tell me it looks good. Now, I put it in the oven. So now that that's in the oven, I can take off my blindfold. Are you kidding me? So, there's a little mess. How did it even get wet? I didn't use liquid. Even my clothes are a mess. I'm going out after this video and I was gonna wear this t-shirt. I think I am officially retiring from YouTube. I didn't even use most of the batter. The only saving grace of all this is if the cake turns out good. Are you kidding? It looks like crap. So here we are. All that stress and effort comes down to this. The edges are pretty burnt, but that's not all that surprising because, yep, definitely should have sprayed it. Why is it so burnt? Oh. I mean, it tastes okay. Burnt, flavorless, dry. Yeah, he'll make it, he taste crap. Maybe if it adds like a really thick, sweet, flavorsome icing. Let's just say, I probably wouldn't make it again. Thanks so much for watching me attempt to make a cake blindfolded. I guess the moral of the story is, if you're baking a cake, stop after you've added the butter and the sugar. It's always nicer then. And also maybe just to not cook blindfolded. This was a horrible idea. But I mean, it was an adventure, and I kind of think it's one of those things that everyone needs to try at some point in their life. Actually, no. I really don't. Yeah, don't try this. Give this video a thumbs up if you like food that's not cooked by a blindfolded person and leave a comment below letting me know what's your favorite type of cake wow theo with the riveting questions you can add me on snapchat where i update daily hey with theo follow me on twitter it's theo mccoy and instagram da zero door thanks again for watching and hopefully i'll see you very soon adios amigos bye oh that didn't even work nothing works